Sure. Um, so I did a little bit of research uh, recently to understand different bylaws in surrounding communities and what they have done to um, combat um, blight, uh, blightened and abandoned properties. Um, so I was able to prepare some preliminary drafts and through you, Mr. Pre Mr. President, and through the town manager that were circulated through um, a couple of the department heads and I was able to get feedback and um, I can incorporate that into a later draft. And the overall um, purpose is to really to protect uh, property values and neighborhood integrity in that area of town. Um, as we all know, uh, vacant properties are at an increased risk for fire, water, and natural damage, as well as um, unlawful entry and other safety hazards. And the bylaw that I've been working on with the helpful feedback of some of the department heads would help to mitigate that and um, give the um, building commissioner more uh, in for and the town manager more enforcement so that we can um, become a more look like a more attractive community um, for these buildings. Thanks, Mr. Scanlon. So what uh, Mr. Scanlon and I had talked about when he first brought this to me was as he outlined, you know, getting some further initial input um, and, you know, really getting the collaboration with the town manager going. And I think our thinking was that we would, uh, you know, love to see the subcommittee, the economic growth subcommittee, maybe take the first crack at the draft that he, he has started working on. Um, then, you know, given the fact that ultimately it's bylaw changes, the kind of the sequencing we thought about was, uh, Kind of initial discussion tonight if uh, if it pleases this council refer to the economic and growth and sustainability subcommittee uh that committee would then uh bring it back to us in a in a revised modified uh form then probably a short stop with bylaws just to make sure that it's uh appropriate and, and then to uh to the committee to vote um, so I, what I'll do is I, ultimately I'm, I'm hoping to get a motion to send this to the new subcommittee. Um, it's a roll call vote. Um, I'm going to finish with Ms. Boyce because I'm not sure we're going to get that. Mr. Simmons. Yes. Yes. Mr. Gregory. Yes. Gregory's a yes. Mr. Lennox. Yes. Mr. Lennox a yes. Ms. Cathcart. Yes. Ms. Cathcart's a yes. Mr. Pare. Yes. Mr. Parr is a yes. Ms. Prescott? Yes. Ms. Prescott's a yes. Mr. Scanlon? Yes. Mr. Scanlon's a yes. Ms. Boyce? She's a yes. Can I take a visual yes like that? I'm going to go. That's a sign ahead. language yes. Yes, that's she sign language. Signed. She has signed yes. So Ms. Boyce is a yes. I keep appointing a yes. That's a 9 0 uh, referral to the newly created economic. Growth and Sustainability Subcommittee. Uh, Mr. Scanlon will send the documentation he has over to Mr. Gregory, and uh, that committee can uh, discuss uh, once we get it quorumed and uh, come back to the council. Good, thank you. Sorry for the clunkiness there.